Good morning, everybody. I'm Lee Nelson. It is Wednesday, June 20th, 2018. Glad to have you with us. And here are five things you need to know as you start your Wednesday. We are going to have to wait until later today to see who won the Democratic gubernatorial race and the congressional district race as a glitch in the ranked choice voting technology delayed the final tabulation. One community in Maine is fighting uh, the Down East Community Hospital's decision to close the Sunrise Nursing Home. The board says they're doing their best to find jobs for the employees and new homes for the patients. Folks in Waterville might be surprised to find some brown water coming out of their faucets. It's because of a broken water pipe in the city. And while the pipe has been repaired, the discoloration is expected to last a week or so. The water is safe to drink, believe it or not. On the national scene, after a visit to Capitol Hill, President Trump faces stiff criticism from both sides of the aisle on his administration's immigration policy. The president maintains that he is powerless to stop the policy, but all indications are that is just not true. And the United States is withdrawing from the United Nations Human Rights Council. The announcement comes just one day after the UN's top human rights official criticized the Trump administration's zero-tolerance immigration policy.